How you doing folks? This is Terry with uh, Ella Cruiser Electric Bikes in Boca Raton, Florida. We're the e-bike superstore here at, at uh, 20th and Federal and 5th Avenue shops in Boca Raton. Uh, what we're going to do today is do a, a little bit of a walk around side-by-side -side comparison of the AdMotor M330 and the Electric XP trike. These are two very popular trikes. We sell a number of here in the shop and uh, they're good for aged but active folks I like to say and also the sport utility bike user who is looking to transport uh, children and or stuff so uh, once again we'll do a little bit of a walk around I'll do a little bit of an intro but it'll give you a chance to see them side by side and uh, let you compare they're, you know they both have good attributes and uh, and will uh, will fit for one rider versus another rider differently and so uh, that thought this side by side would be useful and here we go. Uh, we'll introduce the uh, the bikes and uh, take a look around. Uh, please like and subscribe to our channel. Uh, we're growing it, and it would be very helpful for the channel if you did so. And uh, it'll uh, feel free to comment and let us know what you think. But here we go. Let's take a look at the M330 from AdMotor and the XP Trike. Okay, so um, here you go. Here's the the electric XP Trike on the left, and on the right. We have the AdMotor M330 in cyan, and um, we put them side by side so you could do a size comparison and see what their footprint is like. Uh, please note the M330 has our optional rear bench attached in place of the rear basket. That is an option, but it makes for a nice option. And so the electric is obviously a smaller bike, much more compact. Um, you can see that the handlebars are higher and telescoping on the ad motor and uh, obviously the displays are different. Seats are similar. They both have the nice comfy seat with the backrest. The backrest is higher on the ad motor. And uh, we have the rear. The ad motor comes with uh, turn signals and uh, the, the brake light in the back. It is a um, derailleur driven bike. The front wheel hub motor on the ad motor, whereas the electric has the rear mounted hub motor that drives the rear axle. You'll notice that the uh, ad motor 330 has that uh, back of the seat post battery mount and that's a 20 amp hour battery with the front 750 watt motor for drive. The range on the 330 could get up to 90 miles with that 20 amp hour battery. The electric is, uh, as already mentioned, has the rear hub motor mounted there, that little compound drive system where there's uh, two separate chains. The battery is a 14 amp hour rear back of the seat post mounted battery as well. And the rear light, uh, no turn signals on the, on the electric. The M330 has uh, 20 by 4 fat tires. The electric trike has 20 by 2.6. Okay, well there you have it. Uh, that's the comparison between the XP trike from electric and the M330 from AdMotor. The XP trike has uh, no mechanical speeds, does about 12 miles an hour. Uh, range, I don't know, it's a 14 amp hour battery, so with pedaling maybe you're good to 20 miles kind of thing, 25 maybe. Uh, the Ad Motor is uh, more of a beefy bike, it's uh, faster, it's a 20 on throttle, it's got 7 speeds, uh, mechanical speeds, and uh, you can pedal it out to 25 plus, which is pretty fast for a, for a trike actually. Uh, but it's a 750 watt motor. They're just two different two different purposes. Uh, if you want a nice small compact light duty trike, it's, the, the electric is, is excellent for the price. Uh, but if you want that serious uh, sport utility bike, then the Ad Motor might be the better choice. Uh, kind of up to the rider to make that decision. But at least we gave you that side by side comparison. Again, please like and uh, subscribe. That's going to help our uh, our channel. Thank you very much.